Obviously that guy was an idiot. Who said that all we would have to fight would be wolves. Oh good. I'm not wearing anything. Got everything I was wearing. I was wearing that. Frost troll. And it's hurt already for some reason. It's also a tough son of a bitch. Oh good. I was blocking, but didn't do anything. I have to put all this shit back on. I guess I'll save. Keep fighting this fucking frost troll till I finally kill it. Troll fat. Just wolves, huh? What an asshole. Well, that's all you have to deal with is wolves. <coughs> Nothing else. Shouldn't be anything else. Emblem 5. Man prevailed, shouting Alduin out of the world, proving for all that their voice too was strong, although the sacrifices were many fold. God damn, how much further? <laughs> This place is insanely far away. With roaring tongues, the Sky Children conquer, founding the First Empire with sword and voice whilst the dragons withdrew from this world. God damn, we are high up. <laughs> And that guy walks all the way up here just to drop off food to these fucking guys who don't pay, pay him anything. It's 
tongues at Red Mountain went away humbled. Urine Windcaller began a seven year meditation to understand how strong voices could fail. How much would I bet at the top of this thing's like a fucking dragon or something that we're gonna have to fight? Urine Windcaller chose silence in return. The 17 disputants could not shout him down. Uh, Jurgen, it's probably pronounced Jurgen. Jurgen the Calm built his home on the th throat of the world. That's what we're on right now, right? The throat of the world. That's what this mountain's called. Here we go, finally. Son of a bitch. For years all silent, the Greybeard spoke one name, Tiber Septum, strip, uh, stripling them, stripling then, or stripling then, was summoned to Hrothgar. They blessed and named him Dovakin, Dovakin. Tiber Septum, the guy from the first game, right? The emperor from the first game, if I'm not mistaken. Not the first game, but, you know, Oblivion. The voices worship. Follow the inner path. Speak only in true need. It says, I finally discovered High Hrothgar, so here we are. When they get there, it says, I'll find an offering chest. Here's the chest. Give me anything? Here we go. I'm not trying to. Here we go. I'll return it when I'm done here. A lot of ingredients up here. Oh look, a potion of minor healing. How lovely. We have that now. Kind of ingredients. Okay, let's go in. Let's see what we need to do. Let's see who the gray beards are. Here's one. A dragonborn appears at this moment in the turning of the. Whoa, why did I move? Whoa, who is this fucking guy on my left? That I can't see. We will see if you truly have the show. A dragonborn appears. You call me Dragonborn, what does that mean? First, let us see if you truly are Dragonborn. <coughs> let us taste of your voice. Shout for us, Dragonborn. I did. Then we may have time for questions. I just did. What the fuck? We have to use the other one. Uh, this one. Gotta wait for it to recharge. Do not be afraid. Your shout will not harm us. I'm waiting for it to fucking recharge. Oh, I had to do it at him. Dragonborn, it is you. Welcome to High Hrothgar. Thank you. I am Master Angir. I speak for the Greybeards. Okay. Now, tell me, Dragonborn. <coughs> why have you come here? Who are you? What is this place? We are the Greybeards. Followers of the Way of the Voice. You stand in High Hrothgar the slopes of Kinarith's sacred mountain. Here we commune with the voice of the sky, 
and strive to achieve balance between our inner and outer selves. Okay. I want to find out what it means to be Dragonborn. Well, we are here to guide you in that <coughs> pursuit, just as the Greybeards have sought to, to guide those of the dragon blood that came before you. You mean I'm not the only Dragonborn? You are not the first. There have been many of the dragon <coughs> blood since Akatosh first bestowed that gift upon the world. It's like coffee. Whether you are the only Dragonborn of this age, that is not ours to know. You are the only one that has been revealed thus far. That is all I can say. Okay. Measuring your summons, Master. We are honored to welcome a Dragonborn to High Rothgar. We will do our best to teach you how to use your gift in fulfillment of your destiny. What is my destiny? That is for you to discover. We can show you the way, but not your destination. All right. Ready to learn. You have shown that you are Dragonborn. You have the inborn gift. But do you have the discipline and temperament to follow the path you laid out for you? Uh, that remains to be seen. Without training, you have already taken the first steps towards projecting your voice into a thumb. Right as well. shout to you speak in the language of dragons. Thus, your dragon blood gives you an inborn ability to learn words of power. All shouts are made up of three words of power. And as you master each word, your shout will become progressively stronger. Okay. Master Einarth will now teach you Ro, the second word in unrelenting force. Nice. Ro means balance. Combine it with fus, force, to focus your thumb more sharp. Oh, I see it. <coughs> what the hell? Master Einarth is making. Word of power learned. Balance. Unrelenting force. Master Einarth will allow you to tap into his understanding. 